हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट कोडिंग गाइडलाइंस फॉर कोडिंग कैरोडेट मोजिंग आर्ट स्टडीज दिस एग्जाम इज डन टू फाइंड एनी डायग्नोसिस रिलेटेड टू कैरोडेट आर्टरी और इन सम अक्लूजन हैपन इन आर्टरीज प्रेजेंट इन सेरेबल सेक्शन सो टुडे वील चेक आउट वाट आर द कोडिंग गाइडलाइंस एंड वॉट आर द सी पी टी कोड्स and icit codes used for carotid imaging studies so the cpt codes used here are 93880 and 93882 so 93880 prescription says duplex scan of extra cranial arteries complete bilateral study and 93882 says duplex scan of extra cranial arteries unilateral or limited study so the main difference is one is the complete one another one is unilateral majorly you will find the complete bilateral study which is 93880 and here main reason for performing this exam is to find any diagnosis which are like stroke cerebral infarction occlusion of carotid artery stenosis of carotid artery with or without cerebral infarction so any diagnosis or any occlusion happening in cerebral section or the artery of carotid artery so these exams are majorly used to find any diagnosis related to this diagnosis so it's very easy only two cpt codes are there and majorly you will find the diagnosis of stenosis carotid artery in most of the charts which i used to code and majority of them will have cpt as 93880 and you will mostly find a diagnosis in the conclusion as a stenosis of carotid artery so majorly it will be related to find any occlusion in this um, brain or in cerebral or the carotid artery and also the cpt codes qualify for pqrs so here measure 195 is used so if you are having any client which needs you to code um, the pqrs as well you can use measure 195 for this cpt codes because measure 195 this these cpt codes qualify for the measure 195 Oh thank you for watching this video if you like this video please share it and subscribe to my channel for all updates related to medical coding and